Hello, today we are on the road to Sable sur Sarthe. A nice little track in the middle of the Sarthe region, uh, sort of approaching the Loire Valley in France. The only problem with this track is that, well, there are not enough boxes. So, if you didn't reserve one when you were even thinking about running here, you won't get one. So, consequently, we didn't get one. That means we get to work out of the truck and walk the horse the whole time. I was very careful not to get here too early, so we don't have to worry about too much because this is a two-year-old, which is not the greatest thing to do without a box. But it's an easy enough race for her, and we've been a bit frustrated with her around Paris Pex. So she has to give this a try. Because Sable is about 3, 15, 3 hours 15 from home, um, and it's a Sunday, and we have only the one little runner, I decided I would just do the work myself today and not bring any staff along with this because it's kind of a waste of resources on a Sunday. So um, I have to say that right about now I'm slightly sorry about that decision because this horse has been pulling my arms out and dragging me around the hippodrome because she's a fizzy little characterial little filly. So I will be very happy once we get her saddled, chalky up, and I get to let her go on the race course because then the worst is done. <laughs> um, one other thing is that I put first time blinkers on her today, which it will probably be good for her in the race, but we have to put them on before we go into the parade ring. And that's likely to light her up a little bit more. So she risks to be a little hard to hang on to today. porté par la parole Chine qui a créé un excellent départ et qui est tout de suite en parallèle du commandement. Alors on vient maintenant à l'extérieur du fuse et on tente de venir prendre avantage avec le numéro 2, le King du Fras, le King du Fras qui s'est rabattu en tête maintenant. Alors on vient en seconde position maintenant dire qu'elle est en ligne droite avec un toujours aller même aux avant-postes et Romain Pézi qui a avantagé qui tente de repartir depuis le maintenant avec les deux trois remènes vues à l'avance avec les barres de Sina et puis avec les deux trois remènes qui termine pas vite mais on va s'en poser non c'est des bonnes. So Roger came all the way from Oregon to see this little filly run fifth. No, actually he came for other things too and he's got a horse that'll win later. But uh, we did run fifth, which is, she was in the money, <laughs> which is something. She ran a little bit better than she had been running, which is something. So it was almost worth the trip. Let's see if we can, you know, keep going on that track. The, uh, High school gym complex behind this is where it all happens. I just was in the locker room trying to find the silks. Not a pretty place, huh? But <laughs> anyway, um, nice track. Pretty the facilities location. are okay. Pretty location. What did you think of the food? Uh, the food was okay. The, cho the choices. Fritz? Yeah, tosses were. Sausage the choices fritz. weren't so great. Yeah. But, 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 but it looks like a nice group of people preparing it, and half it looks like half the town came out for the event because there were more people here today. And we're at Longchamp yesterday. Yeah, that's and true. And this is wherever, and that's Paris. Yep. So now yeah. we're going to hit the road and see some yearlings and then hit the road home. See you next Au time. <laughs>